Hi, welcome to the video tutorial on how to download and test the SD time of flight sensor VL53 L1 example application. You can open the browser and go to st.com slash VL53L1X and you could scroll down the page and find the X Nucleo 53 L1 A1 link. And at the bottom of the page, click on the get software button. Accept the license and log into st.com. This will automatically start the download of the software package. Here I'm trying to show you how to find the STM32AC6 project files, extract the zip file, and traverse to the directory as shown in the link below. Two platforms are currently supported, F01RE and L476RZ. More likely, it will be F401RE. Now I'm going to start the AC6 project, edit, save, compile, and run. Click on the .c project file. This opens AC6 IDE, and this may take a while. Select your preferred workspace directory and choose a new one in which to save the file, project files. Expand the project to traverse to the application user directory. Edit main.c to make your application specific change. For instance, change the time budget. Then save the file by clicking on the floppy disk button. To compile the project, click on the top project directory, then click on the hammer button. The compilation may take a while. You can launch a debug session by clicking on bug button, then select debug as AC6 STM32C C++ application. More waiting. Accept the default to confirm the change of perspective. The execution starts with a breakpoint at main. Debug as required. You can check the value of variables by hovering the mouse over variable. You can find the step over resume buttons on the top. Open a serial communication application like TerraTerm. This is the TerraTerm application setup on my system. The serial port settings are 115200 baud rate, 8 bit data, no parity, and one stop bit. On my setup, the COM port number is 4. The example application prints range status, range in millimeters, signal rate, and ambient rate in megacons per second. You can find detailed description in the user manual. 